got some chlorinator. We'll do one part chlorine, three parts water. This thing hasn't been pressure cleaned all winter. It's pretty filthy. Stage one complete, got some of the funk off with the chlorine water solution, it sanitizes a bit. This table always comes pretty damn clean for weight. It's amazing really, these polymers. I mean, there's some stains that just won't ever come out. 
you know, because it is textured, but uh, everything comes pretty damn clean with that little machine. Maybe with a higher power, with a gas one, it would get the last little bit. You're filthy bastards. See, you got these. A little bit, but not bad. White's not, in hindsight, maybe we should have got the, the table in the matching blue, but I like the contrast, the match of the chairs. These come wicked clean. All right, so that's stage one. Everything's somewhat sanitized. Some of the funk is gone. Stage two is going to be to fix all the loose tiles, and then we're going to do a proper cleaning with the gas pressure cleaner with more power with some more chlorine liquid. And then once everything has been moved and super sanitized, then we're going to do the proper... I have all that sealer and the shark skin. That shit costs hundreds of dollars, so... Want to make sure the surface is as perfect as it can be before you apply that. And you mix in the shark skin so you have an anti slip on the tile. So when it's wet, it's nice and safe, especially on that coping. And uh, it always looks wet, only it's dry. And that sealer will really bring these tiles to life. They look so much better when they're wet. So, some more work to do. Going to saturate all, I'm going to move all this, saturate all this with more of the chlorine liquid. And then uh, we'll be in some good shape. Not bad, not bad. Progress. All right. Forward motion. You're a dirty boy, but daddy loves you. Yeah, single boy, but the bear bear. Gotta clean you guys off too a bit, huh? Summertime, sitting outside in the dope Jeep. Poor. Alright, so the cases showed up pretty quick. I've already done the ODG case twice. I figured I'd get something that's closer matched to the actual color of the phone. It's got turquoise, kind of like. They have a black camo coming out in, in July. Black and gray camo. So many snagged that too, but. Uh, Looks more green in person. I don't know why it looks so blue on the camera. It's like a turquoisey. This is called Peacock. So, I'm gonna put my Ultra in my cock and uh, <laughs> it's gonna be greenish. <laughs> what else showed up? Psycho knife. Oh. <laughs> I saw this. I was like, you know what? I haven't bought a Zippo in a while. Cody Green. Why would you put this fucking sticker on here? It's not even an easy to remove one either. Oh, nice adhesive all over the fucking later now. Zip up fluid. I haven't. Come on, you little prick.
the last time I filled up a Zippo lighter. Christ, it's been years. I got a few Zippos here and there. Soak that goodness up. Bone dry, you got to give it a nice soak first run. Was the old trick? Cool. So wait, I'm ADM tube. Though. See how windproof this fucker is with the fan right on me. Nice. Not bad, but it kind of looks like ODG 62H a bit. <laughs> Sal Carrillo does zippos now. Nice. Peace.